我第三十二條咧就係、是、有關於 immunity 免疫力嘅題目嚟嘅。咁啊，免疫力我哋學咗兩款啦，一款就主動免疫，一款咧就係被動免疫。題目俾我哋嘅情況咧就係、是、一個嬰兒咧，佢係會由母乳咧去獲得抗體嘅。咁啊，要我哋做翻分類啦。咁究竟佢係一個主動免疫啊，定係被動免疫啊？咁當然題目就係問緊我哋對於主動免疫同埋被動免疫嘅認識啦。咁啊，主動免疫就係講緊咧呢個免疫力係嚟自於自己整出嚟嘅抗體嘅。咁啊，由我哋嘅張細胞 plasma cell 整出嚟嘅抗體啦。而被動免疫咧，呢、這個免疫力咧係嚟自於由一個免疫嘅 individual。佢傳俾我哋嘅抗體嘅，例如啦，透過母乳傳俾嬰兒嘅抗體啦。咁所以咧，答案咧就 A、B 可以 say goodbye 噶啦。跟住咧，我哋就要處理個解釋咯。咁 C 嘅解釋就係話啦，透過母乳所獲得嘅抗體咧，係唔會導致到呢個嬰兒咧產生呢個記憶細胞嘅。而 D 咧呢個解釋就係話啦，由母乳所獲得嘅抗體咧，就只會喺當嗰個小朋友啊接觸到同一款嘅。病原體呢，先會去做嘢嘅，咁當然啦 ，D 就當然都要 say goodbye 啦，因為作為一個抗體啦，無論你係自己個免疫系統去做出嚟啦，抑或係人哋傳俾你啦，就只要佢見到呢隻 pathogen 有呢隻病原體，而佢個表面又真係有呢隻抗原嘅話呢，其實佢已經會做嘢，都唔好講母乳呢個情況啦。例如講，我哋直接打一啲抗體入去個人身體個雪。我就係因為病緊啊嘛，你直接打啲抗體俾我，就唔該你即時做嘢打病菌啦，係咪？冇理由要等到下一次見到只病菌先打噶嘛，所以咧答案就係 C 啦，係因為你個免疫系統從來冇受到刺激，啲抗體又唔係你自己整嘅，所以咧你係唔會有一個記憶細胞嘅出現啊。So question thirty two is about the type of immunity. So there are two types of immunity. We learn one type is active immunity and the other type is passive immunity. It's given that infants can obtain antibodies from the breastfeeding. So for the options A, B, C, D, which of the following combination correctly describe the immunity in the infant? First of all, we need to clarify the definition of active immunity and passive immunity. Active immunity is given by the antibody produced by your own plasma cells. So that means your body defense system is really activated. And for the passive immunity, is given by the direct transfer of antibodies from the immune individuals. For example, the infants can get the antibodies from breastfeeding. So that's why for the definition, we know that options A and B we can say goodbye today. But for the option C and D, we need to take a look at the explanation. For the option C, it say that the antibodies received from the breastfeeding do not trigger the production of memory cells. And for option D, is talking about the antibodies obtained from the breastfeeding. They will work only when there is reentry of the same pathogens. So we can see that option D is wrong because no matter active immunity or passive immunity, and once the antibody meets the antigen on the pathogens, they will work. So that's why it's not talking about reentry or not. Once they meet the antigen, they will do the interaction. Simple idea is that, for example, artificial passive immunity is acquired by injection of antibody. Means that I'm suffering from a certain disease, and then I really need an antibody to save me at this moment. And if the doctor told me that, oh, Mister Le, this antibody will work only when there is reentry of the same pathogen, so why do I need to take this injection, right? So that's why the answer is C. The antibodies do not trigger the production of memory cells because my immune system is never triggered. Even the antibody is not produced by the infant themselves, so that's why there is no memory cells.